Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John, this is Mini, your true nerd, and welcome to Unravel, a game that's a bit of a mystery to me, because I remember seeing footage of this when it came out last year and thinking, that looks really gorgeous, but I just never really got round to playing it, I don't even know what sort of game it is. I know it's like supposed to vaguely sit under sort of narrative-y, sort of puzzly platform-y thing, but that can mean just about flipping anything, so alright, screw it, let's have a little look see at this. And we begin with an old woman looking at photos, as every truly great game begins. But then a ball of yarn achieves sentience somehow, I feel like we've missed a stage in the process of the creation of life here, but whatever. Then a ball of yarn achieves sentience, and this is me! And I can't remember what his name is, I think he's actually got a name, I'm not sure he's ever actually said in the game, but uh, yeah, this guy's adorable. I love him, I remember loving him the first time I ever saw him. Yes, he's just cute and he's made of yarn he can throw yarn about with a little sparkle. He's not just made of yarn, he's made of stylish yarn. So he's got a little bit of kind of, you know, classy splash going on there. Lovely. Actually, I kind of feel bad already. Because clearly, the ball of yarn that he was magicked out of by like Jiminy Cricket or whatever, is down under this here bench. Presumably, every single step I take away from it, I'm slowly giving up my own life. Like, can I just, can I just actually, okay, I can rewind myself up. That's good, but I can't actually pull the yarn out from under the seat. So I'm kind of stuck. Also, bloody hell, watch out. That's a candle. Stay away from candles. Right. Now, what the actual bloody hell's going on here? It's... Okay. Photo album, but nothing in it. I'm guessing we have to come back to that later. Let's just keep going. It's just beautiful, isn't it? I remember thinking this is just flipping gorgeous. Absolutely flipping gorgeous. Again, fire. Watch out for fire. Right, let's have a little clamber. See what we can find here. And we've got ourselves... Ah! Okay. Thistle and weeds. So, I'm guessing, photo album has no photos in it. Go into a picture, as people looking at pictures seems to be a theme of the game. And that puts a photo back in that photo album. Yeah, sure, that'll do. Thistle and weeds. Let's have a little look see at this picture. So... People on a bench. Ah, this is the classy artistic way of saying everybody died. Except her. She's still there, so you know she's not dead. And now, our cute little guy presumably is in the past, I'm guessing. I mean, I'm guessing he's not just kind of going outside. If he is, he's made even worse decisions than the time decided to hang out by the fire. Right, down the steps we go. Down the steps and... Oh, he's been surprised by a butterfly! This is the cutest game imaginable. This is gorgeous and I adore it already. Hello, just running along through the garden. Hope it doesn't start to rain. Potentially starting to rain is a bad thing if you're literally made of yarn. Also, am I actually getting... Oh my goodness, I'm actually getting skinnier. I'm clearly getting skinnier and less covered in yarn. I'm actually unravelling. No, no, this is unacceptable. <laughs> just form myself up. Get back inside. I'm too cute to die out here, okay? It's not worth it. I know you want to meet the butterflies, but... Oh, I guess we have to go and meet the butterflies. Oh, that's actually really sad. <laughs> I don't like this game anymore because, well, I should have guessed that in a game called Unravel about a guy made of yarn, he'd unravel. But still, I don't like the fact that I'm actually, you know, clearly, visibly unraveling. And, yeah, that's fine. Look, you've got plenty of yarn on your flipping head. Ah, more yarn. I need more yarn. Okay, so just now I need to, hang on, so pull it left. And I've got more yarn. Okay, good. Well, thank goodness for that. Now I've got all the yarn in the world. Except, hang on, there's... Ah! Now I'm... Oh, wait, hang on. No, this is bad. Now when I want to go into the house, is my new anchor... Oh, now I've got an anchor point over here! I'm going to create a massive yarn knot. How am I ever going to get back inside the little old woman or whatever? Oh, bloody dear. And also, grab things with B and move the pots. Okay. Hang on, no. Move the pot more to the left, in fact. Okay, and then I can use- Ah, I can use my yarn to- Oh, that's adorable. That's absolutely flipping adorable, except I'm guessing this is going to need to be in a kind of a midway point. That should about do it. Right, up here, and then jump, and ooh, just, and jump, and ooh, just, nice. Right, next, rope my way across a nice thing here. That's lovely, and there we go. Nice and simple, and over we go again. Why are we in the garden again? Oh, hello. Right, you're not a butterfly. You're a flipping magic thing or something. Okay, except now you're not. Now I've just absorbed the memory. Ooh, possibly I'm eating this old woman's memories. Ooh, 
Ooh, that's, that's kind of more sinister. Like, I know I'm cutesy, but if I'm basically sucking up an old woman's memories, that also seems kind of evil and sinister. Surfaces that glitter can be climbed. Okay, climb we shall then. You can also in midair then throw your rope. Okay, and not quite good enough. Right, and there we go. But then I want to go a bit further down in order to get enough momentum going here. And boom, lovely. Right now, and ooh, I did a little swish. I did a little swish to get myself back. That's adorable. Right now, hang on, press X to... Okay, maybe just let myself go for a bit. There we go. Press X to attach yarn. Make a yarn bridge. Okay, why do I need a yarn bridge exactly? Is that a yarn bridge? Okay, so hold left stick down and release to... Ooh, slingshot! Ooh, okay, and boom, lovely. Okay, that's what I need yarn bridge for. Hello! No, don't go away. I know you kind of live here. It's fine. Right. Now, logically, yarn bridge, and then yarn bridge, and I've also broken an apple. Climb up, and I want to get up to the next thing, right? And boom, and okay, now I've, oh, now I've got flipping apples. Okay, now apple, come with me. Right, lovely. So, remember the rope, and hold RT to climb using the left stick. Can I get up here? Ah, okay, fine. Tie knots while climbing. Right, and then I need to presumably swing a little bit. Oh, I can't swing so much because that's in the way. Okay, now hang it. No, climb up here. Climb up here. Now that. And now if I just climb up top. Aha! Now I've got something I need. And now jump up and up to the top. And I've got some more yarn. Nice. Left stick down and press A to jump down. Okay, fine. Just drop through here. And use the left stick to climb down safely on my yarn tail. Okay, well, hang on. Just to go down here. Yep. So now I can just climb down nice and slowly and safely on my yarn. Not sure it's a tail. I guess it is kind of a tail. But it's also like, you know, literally my entire flipping body. See a whirling light? This means you'll start here if you quit. Come back to this level. Okay, just a restart point. Now just, can we drop down? Or can I just drop down off the edge and then just let myself down and kaboom. And I sort of fell over, but never mind. There we are. Got myself some more yarn. Can I grab the apple, by the way? Can I move the apple? Yes, I can move the apple if that's what I want to do. Marvellous. Now, got a thing here. Okay, not sure what I'd want. You know what? Screw it. I'm just going to create a yarn anchor point. Because that feels like a safe thing to do if you're made out of yarn, quite frankly. And we've got... Okay... Right, uh, I'm guessing I can't go in water, right? No, I can go in water. I am, in fact, adorable. Right, okay, no, 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 excuse me. Excuse me, just go over here and then climb. Oh, uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Problems, problems. Definitely shouldn't be in water if yarn. Apple, save me. Apple, no, you're not saving me. Apple, no. Apple, oh, don't oh, know. I've been killed by an apple. That's fine. That's 100% fine here. Okay, right. I know what I'm doing now. Press B to grab objects, push them up there, and boop, no, jump, and then we've got, okay, this doesn't help me that much, but, ah, am I just needing to pull more apples over the top here? Is that what we're doing? Just more apples over the top. Can I get more apples, please? More apples? Yeah, let's just get some more apples here, just in case I need more apples, because I feel like we need more apples. This isn't a trampoline, it's just being used as a ramp, so more apples over the top, please, and get the third one, too. You know, the weird thing is, I don't really normally enjoy games like this, where it's just kind of, you know, fairly simple, physics-y platforming. But somehow this one's really flipping charming, so I do quite like it. So, put in enough apples, and we'll hopefully have a great big bridge, right? No, no, you need to come down as well, please. You come down. That's right. So now we've got what I'm hoping is going to be a bridge of apples. If this is enough apples. Is this enough apples? Yeah, there we go. Now, bridge of apples. Bridge of apples, because apples float. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Keep floating. No, don't fall in. Don't, don't fall in. Don't, no, don't fall in. Don't fall in. Stay, stay on the bridge of apples. Stay on the bridge of apples. Oh, the apples. I should have got more apples. I don't have enough apples. Uh-oh. Oh, right. No, 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 no. Okay, okay. It's fine. It's fine. Stay out of the water while it's filling up. And then what we'll do is we'll just kind of try and jump across here. Okay. Full pond. Now jump and jump and jump and jump and jump. Yes! Past the dangerous pond. Nice. 
I found someone else's house at the bottom of the garden, or possibly like a shed or a patio or something. Okay, intriguing. Hang on, wait, I think I need to go up here. No, definitely need to go up here, because there's a thing here. Hello? What's this? There we go. Up onto the high road, though I do need to find some more flipping yarn at some point. And then up, and then... Oh, right. I'm actually trapped due to lack of yarn. Okay, I need to wrap myself up here. Uh, where's my... Hang on, is there maybe more yarn down below? I think I need more yarn from... Aha! Ha 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 ha! Yes, that'll flipping do. There we go, just pull this down. Go under here, get myself some more yarn. Now I'm all yarned up and I'm adorable again. No, pull all the loose yarn. Okay, fine, apparently I'm stuck with this yarn here. That's okay. Oh, this is going to be one hell of a tangle when it comes to actually trying to eventually go home to the old woman or whatever. Right, now I've got all this extra yarn. Now I should be able to make it over here and go and go and... Oh, oh, no, careful, careful. And now sunflowers. This is a relaxing game. I like relaxing games. <laughs> relaxing games are good. And extra yarn for me. And down we go. And oh, hello. What's all this? We've got... Something. We've got a... Ah! Okay. We've got a bike. There's also... Ah, there's something down there. Should I have gone and got that? Hang on. Just quickly climb back up here. There's clearly something down there I want to go and get. So I can climb back up here later. So just grab that. Pull it down. And grab a thing. And now I've got a thing. Right, now clamber back up here. Because I've already got to the top there. So I've got a point I can cling to. Back down to the bike. Well, logically, I'd get it from this side and I'd pull it like this. This would be how I'd make the bike go. I'm presuming I need the bike to climb up, yeah, to the top of the fence over here. So that's fine. Here we go. And then we've got a bike there. But now, presumably, I can clamber over the top here. Yep, there we go. And, ooh! Oh, no, I'm taking the bike for a ride! Oh, this game is the most adorable thing I've ever played. I genuinely can't think of anything more adorable than this. So if I run out of yarn here, there's going to be trouble. No, thankfully, there's just plenty of yarn sitting around. Ah, I see. We're supposed to be going up top here. Right. Go up here. Now just clamber up. And actually, no, no. Go back down. I need to swing and then go for that next one. And go. And up. And just keep going up, I'd say. And up. And now, where's the next one? Ah, there's the next one over there. Right, a little bit more. Actually, go further down. Go further down here. There we are. That'll be right. That'll be right. And boom. And now you want me to go over to definitely onto that side. A bit further down just to make sure we've got the right angle. And boom. There we go. Now let's just swing down a little bit here. Just see what you want us to do here. Let's just get up to the top here. Getting up to the top strikes me is a good idea. And ooh, good momentum there. Good momentum. Uh, and now... If I drop... Ooh. I think I might have accidentally found, like, you know, a dead person in the background. And then I kind of absorbed the memory of them without really meaning to. Right, okay. Now get that. Now hang on, get that. And pull it down. And that will give us access to something. There we are. More yarn. But now, thanks to this, I can... Ah, now I can't climb back out because I'm pinned into there. Okay, fine. So I think I missed one of the little flower bonus things. He's got such a charming run as well. He runs so happily. And I've also been hit with a bee block. That's okay. Right. Everything's fine, right? Yeah? Yeah? Need to do something here or... Hang on. What is this? Potentially I need to create a trampoline here. Yes, I totally need to create a trampoline here. Create a point there. And go up to that. And create a point there. And this is what I need to get the bee block. Wherever the bee block needs to go. There we are. And I just realised, of course, it's a B block because you push it by pushing B if you're on a controller. That's adorable. And of course, it's about to spell something. Like, boy, I'm sad my family's entirely dead. But they'll probably be a little bit on the unsubtle side. Got... Oh, hello. Hello, Mr. Hedgehog friend. <laughs> I've got a hedgehog friend and this game's adorable. Right. Pull this all down. Oh, careful. Right. So now I've got this. If I go over here. Ah. Wait, no. I see what we're doing here. I see what we're doing here. Right, okay, hang on. I need to get to... I need to drop down. This thing needs to go over to this side, onto this here, 
paddle because I needed to launch it the other way. So that goes there. Yep, no, don't don't fall off. Help me out here, Mr. Hedgehog. So now if I go over here, logically, then this will... Oh, I thought it was supposed to be launching it, but maybe not. Maybe this is just how I get over to, to this thing. Oh, I'm so sorry, B-Block. I'm actually leaving you behind. Right, okay. Now, I'm going to need a great big swing. That might... No, the angle was all wrong. The angle was all wrong, darn it. Okay. What if I want to... Ah, no. Okay. I see what I need to do. I need to make this swing first. Okay, make this swing. Okay, now release, 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 release. Now hurry, 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 hurry. Right, back, back up, back up, back up. Now, go. And now I can, if I'm significantly... Oh, it loses its momentum pretty fast. Oh, so close. Oh, wait, hang on. Now I can just basically climb up here. And I can just uh, swing on this. Just climb up here. And now I can just make it swing to get over it this way. Oh, that's fine. Okay. Fine, I imagine you'd get like a little extra bonus one if you manage to somehow get on top of the tyre, which I'm sure is a thing you can do. But this'll do. Lovely. Now, got to climb up onto here and I've accidentally locked myself in a dark shed. Oh, this is where the game gets dark, literally. Right, down we go. Hello. What's all this then? Do I need to do anything here? Okay. Can I create myself a little... Tying on point. Okay, there's a tying on point there. And clamber up. And probably create a tying on point there as well. Because I imagine you're going to need me to bring something along here, aren't you? Uh, ooh. Apparently there's a point there as well. Okay. Now, got this. Now I can bring this little... Okay, normally you can bring little boxes along when... Yeah. To that. No. To there. Yeah, that is now glowing, indicating it's one of the special ones that you can actually do stuff with. So, let's just get this up here now. Yeah, push that up there. Good, good. Need to pull that off. I think we might need to undo this as well. Okay, that's fine. Now I need to clamber up here without knocking this one off. Okay, so, this goes here. There we go. Is this now going to go up there? Yes, yes. Boom. Okay, that was fiddly, but we got it. We've got the T or something. We've got a thing anyway. It's all fine. Right. Clamber up here. And we've got ourselves... Aha! A thing. Don't know what those things do, but I found a couple of them. Boom. Oh! Again, bad place to be if you're made of yarn. But I've managed to get back outside to the light, so that's lovely. And now I'm in a pile of autumn leaves. Because <laughs> everything's adorable. And that's totally one of the things I want to collect, isn't it? Although it's... Hang on. Is this pile of leaves breathing? Because I'm not sure I like it. There we are. I've got a new yarn thing. And now I hold it up because I'm happy with it because I've got a thing. And with that... Ah! I got a missing piece out of the book. And now I stick that to the front of the book. And I take the memory, a stole out of the photo, and I put it into the book, I guess. I'm basically going around as a little yarn sprite and creating... Ah, here we are. Thistle and weeds, how beautiful this was when it was new, and how beautiful it still is, even though time has made it different. And as a result, we've got a photo there of... Ah, them just playing in the garden. And all the photos are there. The different areas we saw, all the things that we saw, but now actual photos. And I'm guessing if we go far enough, yeah, that'll be whatever the next chapter is. Okay, so that's what the game is. You go around the house, you find pictures, you clamber up to them using the skills you've learnt in the previous levels in order to get to new ones. So I guess you could just do it in potentially any order, perhaps two or five. Ah, and there's more secrets to find as well, lovely. So we've got the sea and berry mire, though actually it looks like I can't go into berry mire right now. I can only go into the sea. Fine. Can I go anywhere else by any chance? Oh, I do have a nice door handle I can swing on here. So there's the sea or there's off the rails. Okay, so you do need to go into it in the right order. Fine. So the next option is indeed to the sea. And there's down a hole. And how much is enough? Right, well in that case, let's just clamber back up on top here because next up is in fact the sea so i've got to go to the sea presumably when they all went on holiday 
and presumably meet like an adorable crab and an adorable dolphin and an adorable well. You see, there's an adorable crab right there. Okay, it's not that adorable, I'll admit. Though admittedly, I'm less convinced that Yarny here ought to actually be, you know, in a forest down by the beach or whatever. But okay, whatever, it's fine. Let's get him over there and we've got ourselves two kids flying a kite. Hang on, let's just steal that. Lovely. I use the memories of the elderly to power the dark magic that keeps me alive. And now we've got us. Oh, never mind. I've got myself a can. Just get the can going on over here. I assume I need the can to clamber up. Lovely. Though there's clearly something else over here. Let's just clamber up to... No, no never mind. I messed that up. Hang on, hang on. I can get over to that bench. I'm just not sure. Why do I want to be on that bench? Hang on. I can get over to here. And then climb up to here. That's... Ah! Okay. Now. Got to... No, no, no. Clamber, clamber back up. Clamber back up. Proper jump, please. Proper flipping jump. Yeah. Create a tie point. Jump over. Now create a tie point. And now I've got a thing. Ah, and this is going to let me get up to here. Oh, not quite. Not quite, but flipping close. Okay, what's the angle to go for here? Is it more like... Ah, no, it's definitely not like that. Maybe like right in the flipping middle. And jump and go. Nice. I need to come this way. So I literally need to get the... Uh, the next bunch of yarn. Otherwise, I won't be able to get up top. Ah! I'm literally going to get the flipping. Never mind. It's okay. I like the fact that once you've got a tie, you can just climb it back straight up there. So, it's a very forgiving game. Very forgiving game indeed. Right. I need to get up to here. Creating a trampoline between those two. That'll flipping do the job. Right. Over to here. And just... Yes. And, oh. I think I would be allowed to walk through there. It's just I'm actually out of yarn when I'm so close to the next yarn. Okay. I need to untie something, I think. So now I've just got to go up here. And the most efficient way will be to immediately put one tie in here. Okay. Going up this way, climbing directly. Then I kind of climb over here and put another tie here. So I feel like this is the most efficient use of yarn I've had so far. So now, hopefully... I might be able to get over to here, and yes! Kaboom! Right, I think actually the problem was, there down below I was approaching from the left rather than the right. Right, now, get over here, and now I can fly the kite! And the music gets a little bit more up-tempo and everything, and everything's lovely. Let's just fly the kite up a little bit, and then... Oh, I've actually got a bit of control over the kite. I need to kind of avoid the branches, I think, so under that branch... And then, there we are, above, now below. Now I'm a little bit stuck. Okay, the, the kite's naffed off and I'm going to die. Here we go, here we go. I think I got it. This all flipping do. Right. Got myself some fresh yarn, a new anchor point. Lovely. Now I can just, oh, careful. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. I need to work my way, work my way down, but work my way down slowly and carefully. Because I can just kind of grasp myself whenever I need to. Ah, hello. Right, now just no. Round to here. Now I need to jump using this as a point where I can swish over to this yarn. This is going to be a bit of a tight one. And just lovely. Got myself plenty of yarn there. And straight back down to the bottom again. Just grab myself at the bottom. Lovely. Now let's push some pine cones because I might need them to create a water bridge or something. In we go. Yeah, I thought so. Right, in fact, actually, I might need to do... Is that enough? Nope, that's enough. I thought I might need to make more of a pyramid, but we're okay. And slidey slide down. Oh, hello! Hello, you're a crab. Uh-oh. Oh, oh no! What to be friends? Why would you have done that to me, friend crab? Boo! Right, friend crab doesn't want to... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, no. Uh-oh. Go, go. Okay, this is, also, this is also bad in general. No, the crab's coming for me and also I've drowned. Okay, I need to nail the um, swing over the top of it, in fact. Here we go, here we go, here we go, and boom. There we go. Screw you, Mr. Crab. Screw you and your stupid anti-yarn prejudice. Right, here we go. Right, now round, and wait, is that something? That, hang on, hang on. Is that something at the bottom? There's something at the bottom here. Hello? What's this? There's, there's a thing. Is this a thing? I'm just going to create an anchor point there for no well-explained reason. Right, hang on. Now I've done that, I'm going to go over to... Here and swing and swing. Uh, that was a good swing. And ah, more yarn at the bottom though. Right, and just prepare to drop in a second. Okay, prepare to drop and drop. 
And recling. And now need that yarn. Lovely. Right. Get myself some additional yarn there. Very nice. And now up. And probably the best thing I can do now is just basically swing back over here and pick things back up on this one. Because this is a pretty easy swing over to the one on the right and the up. Actually, we've already got enough momentum to pretty much go. Lovely. Now I assume we can get down here, down towards. We're getting close to the beach. Lots of driftwood and whatever. And just pull this out, I'm guessing, in order to crack that open for me. Didn't get crushed to death. Better and flipping better. Okay. I no longer trust that seagull over there. I used to trust all animals, but then the flipping crab attacked me, so I no longer trust sea creatures. It's possible sea creatures are dicks. Okay. No, we're okay. Sea creature has not attacked me yet. Uh, nothing to do but drop down, I guess. Hang on. Yep. Nice and careful, mind. Could drop down over there. Or could come over here. Ah! Uh-oh. Right. Died immediately there. Right. Drop down to this level as before. Now, first thing we want to do... Let's create, yeah, watch out for the waves, they go up and down. Create an anchor point over here, just for safety. Oh, actually, looks like we need to, ah, no, no, don't do that for the time being. I might need the extra yarn, because I'm looking a little bit on the skinny side. Uh, so undo that, and instead, just kind of bring myself back all together. Now wait for the water to come. Okay, I need to see when the water does and doesn't rise there and okay now go 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 oh now i'm stuck down there oh that's no good all that extra yarn is useless to me i'm guessing what you need me to do is yeah create an anchor point there wait for the sea to rise and now jump and fling and clamber up as quick as you can and now create am i safe up here am i safe up here yes i am right anchor points and now I've got a thing I can walk on. Good. So now, presumably, I can get up to... Aha! That'll flipping do. And go! And no! Oh, oh, careful, careful. Bloody hell. Right. Okay, that doesn't help me that much. It looks like it should be able to help me, but that's not quite high enough, unfortunately. Right. Ignore whatever that secret is up top, then. Don't worry about that. Just wait for a big wave. And then we've got... Okay. That wasn't what I really wanted to do, but never mind. Let's just let another wave go past here. There we are, and now just drop down a little bit, and now swing over to the next, and clamber up please. And then straight back down again, and swing, and swing, and clamber up to the top. And I'm very close to being out of yarn at this exact moment in time, so this is a concern, and... Oh, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Nice! Got myself yarn. Kaboom. I can also clamber up here. Get myself back up. Actually, can't get myself back up top. Looks like I might theoretically be able to if I was willing to swing all the way back at this point. Uh, yes, this is what the game totally, well, doesn't necessarily want me to do, but it's anything I can do. And now swing all the way back over here and just give myself a little bit more rope. And now, can I clamber up to here? Potentially, but potentially the more interesting thing would be, yeah, if I need to just give myself a bit more rope. Ah, do I hit that there? No, I just need to swing more. I need to swing more and come on a little bit further down my rope here. Stop swinging, stop swinging, stop swinging. I think I'm actually pretty much as far down as I can go. I think I'm actually at the extent of the which I can drop. Yes, unfortunately, I definitely am, so I can't go any further. Right, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Pull myself back up here. What I think I want to do instead is create a tie point over there. And then uh, clamber up here. Create a tie point here. This has got to be fine for making a trampoline, right? Yeah, this is fine for a trampoline. So now I can get up here. That's okay. But from over here, can I launch myself over to, to there? That uh, feels risky. You know what? I'm going to leave that secret be. Now I'm up top, which is nice and welcome for some reason i'm not sure why uh but on the plus side new trampoline and new trampoline and this gets me up to here i've no idea whether i'm going the main route or a side area right now i'm not sure how open these areas are but oh don't trust the seagull not one flipping bit and i trust the crab even bloody less right well i know i can climb up here this is sparkling hello any chance you're willing to oh okay there's a thing here. 
Let's just shove that off, please. Thank you. Anything else I can grab or push? No. Doesn't look like it. Right, in that case. No, drop down, drop down, drop down, drop down. There you are. Good old Yarny. Right. Shove that in there and we've got... Oh. Okay. Ah! He went to eat that. Okay. And then you just need to basically get over the top of him before he murders you with his pincers because he's a dick. All right. Getting very close by to the beach now. We've been over a pier and whatever. And instead, now we've got to find the... Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. There we go. That's fine. Yeah, that's okay. There we go. Let's just bring this round or something. Wait, what am I doing? I don't even know what this machine is. Ah, but maybe I'm just trying to create a trampoline with it rather than actually keep it turning around. So, trampoline, trampoline. Yep, yeah, magic trampoline. And boom. Lovely. Keep it going. And now I'm... Oh, I'm looking very much like I need more yarn before I go any further. Okay. Where's the flipping yarn? Ah, you're guarding the yarn. Now that trampoline's up, it's not just a trampoline, it's a ramp. Because you like eating clam. So we will push the clam or the oyster or whatever that is. I'm not good at sea creatures. That will now go over there. Hello, look, look, it's an oyster. You like oysters. Now I've got to, uh-oh, it ate it very quickly. But on the plus side, the game has now restarted me here with no crab there, so... I guess I sort of unofficially won, and kaboom, on we go. Maybe you were supposed to, like, you know, push it further away, so the crab had to go further or something. Still, feels like we're getting close to the- Ah! We found the magic memory. Yeah, there we are. Now we just take it to Dumbledore's office and shove it in the pensive. Lovely. Right, more deep water here. Watch out for that. Right, create one tie point, wait for the next big wave to come across, and then we'll make ourselves a trampoline for the next thing. There we go. Now, over and up. You know what? We're already high enough. It's okay. And now we just go boom and clamber up top here. And now we've got this over here. This thing falls off. Bad time. Oh, no, no, it floats. It floats. What I need to do now is, ah, I need to push it further and further and further along and then jump on top of it when the wave comes. Very cool. Right now, oh, no, but that, okay. I've sort of accidentally done the right thing there, I think. Now around here, up the top. Now that thing will now let me ride up here. And now I can climb up to here and put myself one tie thing there. Right, got a tie thing there. Next up, ride that up to here and then climb that up there. I've got one more tie thing there. And then clamber up top here where I think you're safe. And we are... Good boing off we pop. Lovely. We've got oh. Oh, I may pick a bad moment to run here. I picked a very bad moment to run here. Ah, wait. I see what you need me to do. You need me to create actually a magical trampoline rope thing for that thing over in this direction, don't you? Yes you do. Right. Now like that. Now over to here. Yep. Yeah. Create a special rope. From this side over to... There we are, right. Now we've got a magic rope, like here. This works. So now we just need that thing to get up top, which it totally can do. It's just a bit on the fiddly side, because sometimes the the ocean actually pushes that thing up top. There we go. Like, right flipping then. Right, now let's just quickly push that thing out of the way of the tide. We need it over that side, otherwise we won't be able to survive on that side. Because we need our friend, the whatever exactly this thing is. We need it anyway. Right around here. Up top. And with that, we get up top and we get the yarn. Nice. This is very relaxed. Oh, no, not you. No, screw you. Screw you, you bastard. Right, wait for a giant wave and boom and boom. But no, 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 screw you. Screw flipping you. Right, get in the trap if we can. No, sadly we can't make it get in the trap. Oh, we might be able to. Hang on. Just got to pull this and... Yeah, go down. Go down on the ground and like pull this over here. Yeah, ah. Ha, ha, ha. Okay, yeah, yeah. And get the crab in the trap. Get the crab in the... the that, yes, yes. That's right. There's... Okay, why are we struggling to trap the crab? Aha! We've trapped the crab. And now the crab is running around. 
I don't really know what good that does us. Ah, apart from the fact the crab is going to provide me with a platform. Thank you, crab. And even more yarn. And on we flipping go. Now, just swing this in case this does. Ah, potentially more crabs. Yeah, we got more crabs here. I hate crabs. Crabs are the worst. Right, okay. Round to you. And swing, and swing, and swing, and swing, and watch out for the- Oh, he got me! Oh, you bastards! Actually, if I go over the top and get to this one first, I can put the knot in this thing first. With the knot in this thing first, ouch, I can get killed horribly by crabs. Also, weirdly, I'm not dead. I'm actually- the game's not killing me at this exact moment in time. None of them have technically got their claws- Oh, finally they got me. Oh, wait, hang on. I've accidentally lured the crabs over to this side. I think, oh, apart from one over there. Right. If I could lure that crab on the far right a little bit further over, then the fact I can't quite make the jump might not actually matter anymore. Well, let's just get down here. Hello, 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 hello. Yep, yeah, that's right. Why don't you come over here? Yeah, that's right. Why don't you just come over here? And I'll just climb up top here, and now you're going to calm the hell down. Yeah? Okay, now I've lured all of them over there. I'm not sure that doesn't mean any good, but it might do. Because now there's... Well, there's one directly underneath me, but not that directly underneath me. Right, swing and swing and go, go. Yeah! Probably not the intended solution. And now... Oh, my goodness. Okay, so now we're getting into clever stuff here. Tie there. Loop around here, and I've created a pulley system. Nice, or kind of a pulley system. And now I'm back in a dark room where everything looks like it's on fire. That's never a good thing. Oh, hang on. Why am I just like... Wait, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, am I just... No, good, I haven't completely screwed myself up. Good, good. Managed to get some extra yarn there. I was worried for a second. And a bit of swinging and finagling later. And we have indeed managed to make our way to the boat. Though, actually, we could just skip the boat and keep going. Feels like that might theoretically be of use. Yeah, just keep swinging, keeping going. Might be able to make my way over the top. Something a bit better and more... Oh, I went too far. Okay, fine. Well, I'm in the boat now. The boat is fine. I think I was onto a good thing, right? Just pull this. Let's get this here boat started. Nice. And then just use the engine to push the boat. And the boat is on the move. No. Yeah, there was totally more in the shed if I kind of used the uh, the bits at the top of the room a bit more carefully, but that's fine. Now just maybe just quickly pull in my stuff, and now I'm out at sea. Oh no, I'm not out at sea. I've made it over to the far shore. Very bloody impressive. And as things slow down, I suspect I may have got to the end of the level after my lovely little boat ride. Just, yeah, there it is. A little yarn fish. So you just find a little yarn thing connected to the area you've just been into. So a fish for the sea. And Yarny gives the yarn fish a hug. And then strokes it and takes it back home. And he sticks it on the front of the book. And we get to look at all the photos happening. And he also puts the memories in there too. Some places lie far, far away from all worries or troubles. They are treasures. And we get to see all the things we just enjoyed. The flowers and the kites and the bastard crabs. Hate those bastard crabs. Don't remember the bastard crabs. They weren't treasures. They were utter, utter gits. Look at them, stupid yarn-murdering bastards. And the third chapter, of course, is the one next to it. The Berry Mire. So I am guess we're just going berry picking, because it's all very bloody English, all of this stuff. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think you get the point. This is Unravel. It's very, very, very cute. Like, ridiculously cute. And if you like, you know, your cutesy little platformers that are just kind of relaxing. This is just very chill. It's a very, very chill game. I'm not normally one for what are mechanically generally very simple platformers, just with, you know, like a little bit of a gimmick thrown in the form of the yarn, which is making it a bit more interesting, that are clearly mainly focused around atmosphere and narrative. But this is just adorable. I've had quite a nice time with this. So take that as a recommendation if you like. And I have been trying to look at a few more kind of more relaxing games recently. So actually, there are a few more of those coming up too. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been Unravel. Thank you very much and goodbye. Yeah. No, okay, that would have been good if I'd actually hit the ball. And swing! Yes, yes, yes! That is the swing! That is the swing! Come on! Go for you! Oh, yes!
Oh, 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 oh,